We have Rhiannon. This is, uh, again, a beautiful bias gown. This gown is actually cut all in one panel, so you don't have to use the belt if you don't want to, but I love it. It adds, it shows off the waist, kind of like brings the bias gown into the, to the waist. So all the way through, you've got the fit, you've got the cling, but you've got the flexibility. Now, it, this is inspired, I love feathers, I love flowers. It's a little bit of scalloping. So it's kind of like very delicate. Everything starts from the front. So we're sort of coming out, we're coming up. And again, because I love grading and I love a lot, little bit of subtle difference in each piece, it's smaller here. And then they sort of like slowly, slowly sort of open out and then you have the bigger petals, feathers, whatever you'd like to call them at the hem. Um, again, just delicate sequins. I want this to be subtle. I don't want it to be in your face, but it just sort of opens up as you sort of like see and slowly sort of see the detail to it. Again, perfect V, low, but not too low. Wide shoulders. This gown's just a little bit wider on the shoulder. Um, again, she can look beautiful with a bra, but you don't need to at the same time. Bias on the hips, so she's clinging and you get that fabulous shape. Is cut just a fraction higher than some of the other gowns. Again, you can definitely easily wear a bra under this gown. If you wanted to, you don't need to. But also, if you did, you can easily make her into a very low back if you wanted. And then again, the petals. I've got this sort of like shape coming down. So it's emphasizing the bottom and kind of like really showing off your figure to the best possible way.